Workout in the heat, John. How would you assess that? Yeah, it's a physical workout. I was um, really impressed by them. Uh, their physicality was strong and good, and uh, especially in pre-season, a really good test for us, to be honest. That's exactly what you want in pre-season, isn't it? Hot yeah. day, yeah. tough workout. Well, I don't want it this hot, but uh, <laughs> I would say I, I really like the way they went about it. The, the attitude to be very physical and strong, and um, really like a match day for them today. Uh, not like a pre-season friendly, so it was a test that we needed. A little um, jolt, I feel, that we probably needed as well, so it was good. Yeah, and you look like a team that have been pushed hard. I mean, obviously, it's three weeks into pre-season now. It's, yeah. you're, you're halfway there. Yeah, you're halfway there, but still, it's only we tried to uh, have the group 45 minutes each. That's nowhere near the finished article. A lot of chopping and ch changes there, just to have a look. And uh, obviously, it'll be uh, starting to be trimmed down a little bit now and um, gearing towards the main focus of having a look at the group, the, the main group. You had Jay Williams on trial today. Could you explain the situation with him at the moment? Yeah, just had a look at Jay. He's a free agent at the moment, an opportunity to have a look and um, see how he's gone out and developed with other people. He's been at Harrogate and gained experience there. And uh, he came in today, an opportunity for him. And, uh, you know, we'll see over the next couple of days he's how that develops. So he's a player you know very well as well. Yeah, no, know very well as captain of a youth team. But, um, yeah, just having a look at many players at the moment really. Another one just about, got the full 90 today, are you any closer to making a, a call on him? Yeah, we'll see over the next couple of days. Yeah. And just generally on the squad, I mean you're looking pretty good all around, left back is obviously a position you're potentially looking to strengthen, is there anywhere else or otherwise you're pretty satisfied with what you've got? Yeah, look, as I say, we're looking at the whole squad and the balance of it and uh, there's a few things to consider at the moment. Um, as we as we see as the the games roll on now it'll probably start screwing down um, more of a, a not a starting 11 but getting closer to that really it's gonna be tough to make some decisions right you've got some serious select selection dilemmas there yeah but they're going to make sure that individually each player has to make sure their performances uh, are top-notch and uh, they're not leaving themselves open to be left out and uh, yeah, so we've got to get to that stage where players are uh, in that position uh, to make sure they're cementing down a spot. And, uh, um, you know, over the next, uh, you know, 10 days, I expect that from, from all of them. I'm just looking ahead, you've got two friendlies in the space of 24 hours. What's the plan with, with those two? Nottingham Forest and Russian Diamonds? Yeah, I think you'll, you'll see uh, more of a um, stronger side against Forest on the Tuesday. Um, with all the... Uh, the isolation at the moment we'll, we'll see how strong we can go and then obviously uh, 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 probably uh, more younger squad on the, the Wednesday and the Forest obviously a big club that would be another another tough test another... yeah different type of test probably uh, a lot of out of possession work uh, they'll probably dominate the ball and uh, it's how we deal with that and how we play on top of that okay, okay. thank you